past years, eSports has become popular not just at home, but on college and university campuses alike. At Jarvis Christian University in Hawkins, students are having the opportunity to hone their skills at a camp and also learn what opportunities are out there for them after college. KLTV7's chief photographer, Arthur Claiborne, brings you that story. I don't even play, man, it's still going to whoop them. It's, it's simple, really. Big C, baby, what I'll tell you out the gate. Gaming and esports, um, it's a gateway into what we call um, technology, IT, cybersecurity. When you talk about IT, cybersecurity, they might not be that enthusiastic, interested. So we kind of use gaming and esports as a forefront to get their minds excited. Okay, y'all still got two quarters left. Come on now, you know how to do it. Thank you, use the click, come here. I just learned it was a real job opportunity that I, like, I know I'm good at. I play football myself, so that's what I'm really trying to go to college for. But yeah, if I did have the opportunity to do this, I will. I tripped over my own dude. A PC gaming versus gaming consoles is that a lot of um, gaming people use PC gaming as the, one of the more modern type of gaming systems they use now. The PS2 was the most sold to PlayStation when it came out. And then there was like a bunch of gaming stuff out that I didn't even know about. Triangle was wide open. PC, this is second one. He ain't even tackle, he just tripped. Professional gamers, um, we like to say the lifespan is about 25 years. Backroom staff, being in the offices, making the decisions, making the games, designing and, you know, designing the games. So that's, that's a more, more productive career path for them. And that's so cool. The camp will wrap up tomorrow morning with awards and t-shirts being handed out.